Hi, welcome to this demonstration of fingerprint based exam hall authentication system. Now this is a very innovative system where the student, the candidates will actually be authenticated by their fingerprints to enter into the exam hall. Now this system is based upon the AVR family microcontroller of Atmega328 and uh, this is the system in which we have four buttons namely the enter, back, up and down. Then this is the LCD which will actually display the various information. This is the buzzer and the LED which will be up when the user is authenticated. This is the fingerprint sensor uh, through which the, actually the students will be authenticated. And this is demonstrated as a door of the exam hall. The whole system is powered by a 12 volt transformer. Now let us see how the system works. So as soon as we turn it on, it will see that uh, it will just uh, search for the sensor and when it's found, then it will initialize the sensor with the system. Now the system has started. Now it is asking for the user to first enroll his finger or he can start. But as the system starts, there is no fingerprint enrolled in, already in it. So we will enroll a finger. Let's press enter. Now again it's asking to press the enter button to register a finger. Now the user will place his finger over the fingerprint sensor. So that uh, his fingerprint will be registered as ID number 1. So while registering, the user has to twice place the finger to uh, get the system authenticated himself. So let us place it second time. Now as the prints have matched, so the candidate has been registered with uh, ID as 1. Now let us register an another finger so that we can demonstrate multiple users as the system can store up to 100 candidates. So let us register the other finger by pressing enter button. Let us place our finger on the sensor. So it has first authenticated first. Uh, now let us place again the finger. As the prints have matched, the candidate is registered as ID number 2. Now let us register another finger. You have to place the finger properly over the sensor. And for the second time, as the prints have matched, so this candidate is saved with ID number 3. So now let us actually start with the system to uh, authenticate the user or the candidate or the student to enter the hall. For this purpose, we will press the back button to go to the main menu. Now, press, now we can press the down button to go to scroll down to the start and press enter to start the system. So now the system has started and it's asking for the user to place press enter and then place his finger over the sensor so that he can authenticate himself to enter in the hall. So let us press the enter button and place our finger on the sensor. So as the user was authenticated, so the door opened with a buzzer LED alarm and it closed back again when the student entered into the hall. So now let us uh, see the second student entering the hall. Press enter and then place the finger over the sensor. So the candidate 2 was also authenticated and as he goes inside, the door will close. So now let us test for the third user. So now third user tries to authenticate himself and is authenticated. So as soon as the user goes in, again the door is closed. Now let us simulate that a user which is not registered, he will try to enter the hall, exam hall. So let us press enter and place a finger which is not registered with the sensor. 
so it will say that the candidate is not authorized so in this case as the user wasn't authorized during the registration process so he wasn't authorized to go into the exam hall